Hey everyone, New England Gardening here. This fig variety is called 160-50. Uh, another number uh, for a name, like the 143-36. But this fig here I had last year for the first time, and it had that ooh factor where it was just different from everything that I had had up to that point last year. And I'm trying to recall the taste. It was, again, it was a sort of some type of spicy note to it, similar to the 143-36. Uh, but yeah, it really was interesting and unexpected. So um, here's a couple more figs. I just this one just practically fell off. It seems to be very ripe. Hopefully, it isn't sour. So uh, get to see what a very ripe 160-50 fig is. And then there's this one here, which not too attractive. It has uh, I think that's the rust uh, showing up on the fig now that we got all these cool temperatures but the fig that I had last year was a very nice looking fig and again very interesting flavor very nice flavor to it so let's take a look at this and I've got a couple more on here but you can see the rust showing up it's just the cooler temperatures it's just the seasonal thing it's winding down and uh, the trees are showing their age and soon the leaves will be falling with the cooler temperatures but let's go take a look at this fig okay so let's let's take a look here okay, that one looks like it's it's good See the sort of an elongated shape to these figs here. Let's give this one a try. Well, I'm not detecting that special flavor I remembered from last year that caught my attention. Uh, the skin's kind of tough now. I think with these cooler temperatures. Last year, it was a two-year plant. I had it up against the foundation wall, southern facing, and I got a fig a lot earlier on in the season. It was still pretty warm out. I think it might have been in August. Um, so I think that the fig's a little bit different now with this late ripening fig. I'll give this one a try. Hmm. This one here is a little bit more ripe, a lot more thicker um, consistency to the pulp, a little bit sweeter. But again, I'm not, I'm not getting that wow factor I remember last year. So it's probably due to the just the fig ripening late in the season here. But still, it's giving me a nice fig late in the season, and um, no splitting. Somewhat closed eye, but good fig. So this is New England Gardening, and this is 160-50. That's a UC Davis fig. That's the source of this cutting. So thanks for watching.